Hey, today on Doodle the Travel Bug, we make the trek to Riverside, Iowa to visit the future birthplace of Captain James T. Kirk. So where are we going today? Today is kind of like your Father's Day present. We are going to Riverside, Iowa. Yay! <laughs> you excited? I am. Do you know it's there? I do. You do know it's there? I do. It is the birthplace of Captain Kirk. The future birthplace of me, because that ha the event hasn't happened yet. Right. All right. J just making sure you know. Uh, yes. All right. Thank you. All right. We made it. So we are here at the future birthplace of Captain James T. Kirk, and I have to say we're here more for Jim because he was a fan of the series, and I don't think my boys have a choice, but they'll probably grow up being fans too. Um, but I was really excited to come here, and don't hate me, but I am not a fan, but I was still very excited, and the reason is because it's a really great story. Like most of our travels, like the largest ball of paint or Barney's toilet seat museum, it's more about the people that we meet and their stories and less about what we're actually seeing. And what's great about this story is back in the 80s in Riverside, Iowa, there was a councilman who was a huge fan of Star Trek. He was a Trekkie and he read the book and he knew that they mentioned that Captain Kirk was from a small town in Iowa, but they never named the town. And he just took advantage of that. He, he, he went to the other councilman and the mayor and said, we could be that town. They don't name the small town. We're a small town in Iowa. And that is what they did. They called themselves and the whole town is all in on it. They have a, a Star Trek um, festival once a year and there's signs of um, the actors from the show just line the streets and there's a, a museum here and they're just, they're all in. And I think the coolest part about all of it is in the 2000s when they rebooted the series into movies, they actually name Riverside, Iowa as the future birthplace of Captain James Kirk. So kind of a cool story, brought a lot of tourism and bucks to this small town and it's just cool to see anybody do what they love at 11 and they're doing it at 11 here. So that's it. Trek Fest is their annual festival that happens at the end of June. Riverside also has a small museum dedicated to all things Star Trek. Admission is free to this low-tech and home-built museum that holds such artifacts as partly smoked cigars of William Shatner. I am out front of Murphy's Bar and Grill. And inside, they have a pool table that if you slide underneath it and you look above the pool table, there's a plaque and it says that Captain James Kirk was conceived here. So I told you, the whole, whole town's all in on this. So good for them. For more unique travel shows, like and subscribe to see where Doodlebug goes next.